Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Seasons Ambitions Edition. I'm Landros, and here we are at episode 20. Brighton's on his way home, Jillian's still over there reading her book, and then Chance should be on his way home as well. It's not too late, actually. I'm going to go ahead and let Chance, <laughs> you're going to go ahead and pay the bills. And Brighton, let's see, what do you need? You need to eat something real quick. Uh, let's go ahead and have some autumn salad, and then you definitely need a shower. You might as well go ahead and take care of all your needs real quick. Um, he's not too tired, so th what I thought I would do is I'd let him go ahead. Oh, he needs... He needs scrap. You know what? It's not late. Go ahead and eat. Oops. No, you can eat. I'm sorry. I don't mean to stop you from eating. Go ahead and eat that autumn salad. I'm going to send you back out because we can't really do anything else if we don't have scrap. So I'm going to send you over to the junkyard. Chance, I could let you help him, but you do have school in the morning. And since you've gotten all your work done and we're trying to get on the honor roll, I think what I'm going to let you do is go ahead and let's see. Was this your painting? No, that's not yours. Um, I'm going to let you go ahead and work out for a little bit. Not with a grave. Okay, I'm going to let you go ahead and work out on cardio. That's what you wanted to do anyway. And then Jillian, I'm going to send you home. You're good, but you didn't finish reading your book. And when you do finish, come home and finish. Uh, we'll let you read the book there. Hopefully, yeah, that's good. All right, so Chance, let's go ahead. Or Brighton, let's go with you. Let's get some of the scrap done. And that way we can continue on. Okay, you're up to level 8. We don't have much more to go, but these are the hardest two to get. And then we can start really making some of the good stuff. And that'll be when we can make some big money. Now, I went in to Edit Town before I actually started the game, and I was looking to see what houses were available, if we could afford anything. And the problem wasn't so much the money this time, it's the fact that there's really nothing out there except one bedrooms. So every house that we would get into would be almost the same situation. It may be in a better part of town, but it really just doesn't do anything for our situation. We're actually sitting better with the two bedroom right now. So I'm gonna have to hold off on moving them, even though I'd like to. But there is one house and it's one guy that lives by himself and I thought about moving him out. I hate doing that, but I thought about doing it just so we could take his house. It's a two bedroom as well and it's in the nice side of town. All right, so we got that wish taken care of. You are not getting that yet. Let's see, what is this? Build an improved widget, we can do that again. I would love to buy Bone Hilda. Bone Hilda is the best, and I'm gonna lock it in, but I'm not sure we're gonna do it. But to me, that is probably the best thing that they've added in the game. Okay, Jillian, you're at home, I hope, reading this book. Other than that, I think your needs are okay. You're kinda tired, but you might as well go ahead and eat something before you go to bed. And then when you're done with that, you can go to bed. Okay, Chance, it's getting a little late, and I know you're well, let's see, you're close to leveling up, aren't you? Mm, but not close enough. Let's see, all your other wishes, let's see, the opportunities. You just want to get on the honor roll, that's the only thing there. I need, you didn't finish the books, I made you stop. So if I would have let you continue reading, that would have been fine. Um, yeah, it's late. Let's go ahead and get you in bed and have you go to sleep. I don't think you needed anything else here, so you're fine everywhere else. All right, you guys are taken care of. Brighton, it's back with you. You're still working on this main jump pile. Of course it's now making you all nasty and dirty. Did I put a shower in over here? No, oh, I didn't. I was going to go back in here and put the outdoor shower. And that way when he's over here he could actually get cleaned up. But I forgot to do it. It's not a big deal, but it is something that would be nice. Okay, wait a minute. What is this? Build a widget? It was just worth how much? 400? It's better than that one. Sorry, we want the rocking chair, but we're going for points. And let me see how many points he's got. 29. Okay, this is something I was also thinking about on um, the lifetime reward points. In a lot of my games, I'm not really using the lifetime reward points. In some of them I am, but in some of them I'm not. And I'm, I'm kind of thinking or leaning towards the idea that when they hit elders, since we lose all their points anyway, and we don't get any money for them, I might wait until they become elders, and if they have at least 30000 they can turn them in for the inheritance reward. And then that would kind of be like having life insurance. I mean, that's just my thought. So if you disagree or if you agree, let me know. But that's what I was kind of thinking. Okay, Jillian, you don't need to be up all night reading this stupid book. Because what time is your job? Yes, yeah, in nine hours. You better hurry up. Um, oh, we have not done any of this. Well, we've been We've been holding meetings, and you're doing good there we got to work on your boss. That's the big one. So tell you what, finish this up. Do you really have to eat? No, you really don't. You should, but you don't have to. So I'm going to let you go ahead, get this book done, because you need 
you need to actually get this built up a little bit. And I think reading this book, you get a cash reward, and I believe you also just get a better relationship with, I believe, your boss. Okay, your boss, it will increase your job performance, and it will uh, increase your personal relationship with your boss. So that's perfect. That's what you needed. And when you get up, hopefully you're going to have enough time. I'll let you eat some of that autumn salad. Right, and you got all that scrap. Man, oh, he's exhausted. Yeah, I can't let you do this all. Oh, no, that's Jillian. Hello. But Brighton, you're exhausted too. Okay, so I can't really let you do this all night. I mean, I'd like to, but let's go ahead and let you just do this one oh, little pile, and great. then you can go ahead and go on home. Mm. How much do you have already? Not a whole lot. And yeah, we could buy it through the workbench, but I don't mm. really want to do that. So when you're done with that, we'll go home, mm. and we'll get you, we'll get you cleaned up, and get you in bed. Man, you're gonna be out here all night long. I guess you just need to spend a day coming over here and getting all your scrap, and then you can vent for the next day. But right now, I haven't really, haven't really been as strategic with that because we were trying to do other things. All right, and that may be what we do today. We may just go ahead. Let's get you in the shower because you don't want to go into bed being that nasty, and then you go to sleep. Okay, chance, you are hungry. So when you get up, let's go ahead and use the bathroom real quick, and let's get you something to eat. I'll tell you what, mom's probably going to take that last autumn salad. So I'm gonna just have you have cereal, Jillian. How much time do you have? You're going to be getting up pretty quick, and you did not do much. This is why I like having the elixir skill, or the alchemy skill. They can actually start creating the invigorating elixir, and so then basically you reset your um, energy level. It's not a cheat, because they're doing it in the game, but we don't have a high enough... Well, we do have a high enough skill. I think she can learn. She knows how to make those. I don't think they're in her inventory, though, are they? No, she has it. I think she knows Jar of Friendship. That's it. All right, who's coming back? Who do we have tonight? Okay, it looks like Finn's made it back here for us. Well, hi, Finn. What are you going to do? Brighton's not even fooling with you. He's not even bothered by you. Okay. Well, Finn, where are you going? In death as in life, you just wander around aimlessly. All right, I'll be back in just a minute when they're all up and ready to go. Well, that didn't take long. Finn decided to stay here and watch TV. So I don't think we had a TV when he was alive. Or we did, but I don't think it was working or something was wrong with it. Well, Chance, I told you what to do. Go ahead and get... And then I want to make sure that you didn't have that same clothes. I didn't look at you yesterday um, for that magical makeover because I really don't want you going to school dressed up the way you were dressed up. Okay, and I don't know how long Finn's going to stick around. Probably till about 8, and then he'll leave. Somebody ought to clean up these clothes. I guess it could be me. And we have not done laundry. This poor little toilet over here is overflowing. That's okay. We're trying to do our... We're trying to do what we can do. Okay, are you even going to notice that your grandfather's there? Alright, Jillian, you need to go. Uh, get up. You didn't get to eat, and you're probably starving. Oh yeah, you're hungry, but you'll get you'll get lunch at work. So, well, you finally noticed he was there, but you know, don't let that stop you from eating. All right, Brighton, Brighton, you're actually. Shake, shake, Zarposa. You could talk to your grandfather. Oh, you are okay. So at least you're not. You're kind of over it. And his. Oh. Um, School career. Let's see how he's doing. Oh, he's good. He's on. He's on the honor roll, so he's fine. I think he had to be on it for three days. Oh, we're a negative one. Did I really have you down that low? I probably probably did. This should do it. I think you got to stay on it for three days, and then it starts counting. I don't know, or something like that. I can be wrong. I have no clue. I just know that keep their homework done and keep them going. on the Okay. All right, Jillian, let's go ahead and have you work. You're going to suck up to your boss because that's that was one of your big things. Um, of all of them, that's the one that you're at the worst. So go ahead and do that. Okay, did you get any money for it? No, of course not. So suck up to the boss. Do what you can do. Um, she likes work. Chance, are you ready to go? Okay, good. So it didn't change his clothes permanently. It was just a real short-term makeover. All right. You're on your way, and I'm going to have a chance. Hopefully, you're going to be meeting all your friends. I think you've met just about everybody, but let's go ahead and make sure. 
meet new friends, and then Brighton, don't sleep all day. Yeah, you can go ahead and get up, Brighton. I'm sorry. No, that was Chance. Chance, go to school. Go to school. And meet new friends. Oh, watch what you're doing. Now he's going to take a taxi. Brighton, now let's take a look at you and see how you're doing. Oh, yeah, you need to sleep. So go ahead and sleep. Jillian, as long as you get fed, you'll be okay. So what I'm going to have you do is go ahead and after work you're going to hold the meeting. That way you'll make a little bit more money. So you guys actually have a decent amount of money in, in your account right now, which is good. Can you hold two? We can try. <laughs> Probably not. Okay, Chan uh, Brighton, you have got to get going. We can't let you sleep all day long, even though you want to. Um, what I think I might do is let you go ahead and just spend today doing nothing but... Okay, there goes Ben. Let's see, let me let you sleep till about 11 and then you're going to get up, regardless of whether you want to or not. Alright, I said 11, I'm going to stick to 11. There we go. Okay, you're going to get up, you're going to eat, and then I'm going to take you back over to the junkyard. And we're going to get all the scrap in the, junk, in the junkyard today. And then tomorrow... You won't have to worry about it. You can actually level up, hopefully, because you'll have enough scrap. And we're going to get that done. So go ahead. Right now, I'm going to speed you up because I don't want to watch you eat. Not that you do it wrong. It's just I've seen it now a million, a million times. Okay. Let's go. Why are you... Oh, is that nasty? Yeah, you ate disgusting food. Oh, Okay, I'm sorry. You're going to throw up on us, and that's okay. We're going to be in a place where you can throw up, and nobody's going to know. All right, get to the junkyard. Mm. Yeah. Okay, and from fresh clothes... Who got the laundry? Did you get the laundry? Nobody did. At least I didn't see anybody get it. We just keep forgetting to do the laundry. That's the one thing that I like it, but I forget about it half the time. Okay, here we go. Junkyard... Let's get as many of these as you can. I think you've already got this one taken care of. Yeah, that one's done. That one, it's not sparkling. You can do this one. And that one. And then when you're done, you can start detonating. And we'll collect whatever scraps we get. Wait, I'm not going to detonate everything because, you know, one, one detonation will actually kill or do a bunch of them. Let me just double check that there's nothing we want to salvage here. Yeah, we could detonate these, or we could salvage them. And of course it's going to rain. I should have known. And we ought to collect this, whatever that is. So, I don't know what it is, but I'm going to collect it before we start detonating. Actually, no, I'm not going to cancel out, since we already know where that stuff is. Okay, there's some... Um, that's a kid's chest. Alright, lots of people coming out over here at the junkyard. Let's see, is there anything else we can collect? Yeah, we want to collect these things. I don't know what they are. They can be valuable. They can be worthless. Come on, Brighton. Let me speed you up real quick before you throw up. In fact, I ought to go ahead and get rid of this detonation because I don't know how much you're going to get to do before. We'll detonate a little bit. It's already 2 o'clock. Man, it goes really quick. Uh, build a bridge at Starry Community School. There's no reward. Um... There's a reward sculpture. <clears throat> uh, making sure he shows up with strong handiness skills and in a good mood. Does, does he know how to do this? Mm. Alright, we're going to do it. Because I've never done it. Chance. Let's go ahead and find where you are. <clears throat> go ahead and build the bridge. And I'll go back to Brighton. Right, and you're going to take care of your... Yeah, you got to go throw up. We'll do it. Is somebody in there? Oh, yeah, somebody's already in there. Why aren't you nice just to sit there and wait? I'm going to speed you up because we need to get this done. All right, Jillian's countless hours of cultivating relationships with people of the town have made her popular enough that her write-ins have actually gotten her elected to governor, which is level 8. In, uh, hmm. Should she leave her current position in vice president job level 7? If we do this, we go to the governor and do the political career, we have to basically start over with charisma, and I don't want to do that. So she's going to keep the job she's got. 
I mean, I love the Christmas scale, but you really have to start working on it early if you want to build that thing up and not have it be a pain, because then you're spending time just trying to meet everybody. All right, so she made a thousand seven today, and she's doing some uh, meetings. Okay, I think I collected everything that I saw over here. I'm not sure about that one, but I think we did. And I'm gonna leave you for a minute, make sure. Okay, Jillian, you're fine. Chance, let's go over here with you for a minute. You are kind of hungry, and I'm not gonna make you go home and eat. I'm gonna actually take you out, since it's still pretty early. Didn't you have an after-school thing? He built a really awesome bridge and convinced other Sims that he can carry weight as shop captain. He was awarded a really cool reward sculpture. Okay, gotta look at that. All right, you are gonna go, where is it? You can go up in the map view, I can't tell from here. It's down here. I'm gonna have you go over here and eat. You can go eat by yourself. I know, that's sad. But at least you don't have to go home and cook and have autumn salad again. I'm getting sick and tired of autumn salad. I'm sure he is too. Okay, these horses need to go somewhere. That's not the best place for them. Now, Brighton, hopefully you are getting all this stuff done. Get in there and do that. Jillian, you're still doing your meeting. Chance, when you're done, you can go home, and then you can do your homework once you get home. And this auto... Oh, he's got um, wildflowers to sell. So you go home and do your homework after you eat. Brighton, you should be doing pretty good. Uh, yeah, your needs are okay. But we need to get this done. I'm going to speed you up so you can get through this. And... I have no idea how much... Okay, she made $7.50. Let's see if she's doing another meeting. Oh, she is. Jillian, your energy is not too great, but you know what? If you can make money doing this, then let's have another meeting. Could I do two? I'm going to try it. I don't care. We're just, we're getting greedy for the money. All right, Brighton. See, that's what I should have been doing the whole time. I just, or I don't know, maybe she had to be at a certain level to hold meetings. I think she did. Yeah, Brighton, you're nasty, and you're probably going to have to go to the bathroom next, but that's typical. Alright, so she made another 750. And Brighton, we never did even get to the consignment store. Ugh. It's the one thing I just keep forgetting. I don't prioritize. But we need this. We need this in order to get up to the higher level. Let me see how much you've got. You got 166. I could probably let you stop. Alright, chance, I bet your homework is done. Okay, is it done? Or maybe you're doing it right now. Oh, you're going to read that book. Okay, you finish reading that book because you needed to do that. And I'll sell... Oh, man. Build a harvester and deliver it to Jeffrey Castor. Yes, we'll do that. Um, unfortunately, we can't sell it because that would actually give us some decent money. I'm going to sell these wildflowers, make sure that we don't have anything else to worry about. I'm surprised you didn't get... Um, oh, you got a disgusted mood look for something. It's probably... Oh, it's a nasty food in front of you. Well, I'd be disgusted, too. Okay, and then there's your jersey, and you got your award. I'm going to put those up on your wall. Okay, there's your signed jersey, and then this one. Wow. Oh, wow, from Shop Club. That's pretty nice. It's a big old saw. Okay, anything else in here we have to worry about? No, that's that's his homework. It's current homework. And everything else, yeah, I could get rid of some of this stuff. This was actually his mirror. Can it go back here? Okay. We'll just keep all your stuff out and get it out of your inventory. And I think that's all I need for you. Jillian, you're going to continue working. I don't care if you're about to pop. You're going to come home and go to bed after you're done. But you're going to make some money. Brighton, keep going. I'm not going to let you do this all night long. But I'm going to let you do this for a little bit longer. Oh, you've already made your harvester, so you could go deliver it. So once you're finished with this one, I'm going to let you collect and do this. Finish up in this pile. Please tell me you're not digging through that one. No, we're not going to dig through that one. Just collect these other things and then go deliver before it gets too late. Come on, Brighton. Dig faster. If not, I'm going to have to just stop you. Yeah, I need to probably stop you. Sorry. Otherwise, you're going to do this and it's going to be after midnight. You're not going to be able to go to deliver this thing. Which you probably still won't anyway. It's already 11.15. Come on, I'm going to go with you. Let's get this over with. 
Oh, right, where's this guy? Oh, he's over at the... Oh, he's at the laundromat. I thought we were going to go to his house, which would have been different. But this is good. We'll get this taken care of, and then you can go home and um, get cleaned up and go to bed. Barbel plants, mana. Uh, okay, you made some money. Well, you made a little bit, at least. Alright, so I'm going to send you home. Jillian, you should be out. Oh, yeah, she's at home. She's in bed. Chance is in bed. That's good. So tomorrow, my plan with Brighton is pretty simple. I'm going to actually take him to the consignment store, and I'm going to let him put his stuff up. Okay, wait a minute. Uh, that's worth 1500 That's worth 5000 750 Okay, you're out of here. Um, we're going to take him to the consignment store and let him put some stuff up for sale. Then he's going to come home, and let's see how much scrap he ended up with. 214 That should be enough to get some basic stuff done. And then we'll hopefully get him... I want him to build the time machine. That's what I'm trying to earn, so work towards, but I haven't been pushing him very hard. So at this point, let's see, get your shower done. Okay, then go to sleep. All right, and other than that, yeah, he is kind of hungry, but it's okay. He can he can survive till the morning. I'll get rid of these foul quality dishes. Okay, I gotta go to the, this one, because that one's full. All right, I'll be back in just a minute when everybody's up and ready to go, and we'll be working with Brighton and get him get some stuff up there for him to sell. So I'll be back in just a second. Okay, everybody's up, and Jillian, everything's good with her boss and everything, but she needs to really work on her coworkers. So, Chance, you've got school going on. I have him cooking, so hopefully he doesn't do anything bad. But I'm going to get Brighton out of here. We're going straight over to the consignment store. Oh, not the fire department. We're going over here now, and hopefully they're open. I don't know. It's still kind of early, but I want to get them get some of his stuff sold. Or at least get it out there, because when I looked at his career, it just was depressing. He's only at a level four, and all he has to do is sell things to make money, and he can level up pretty quick. So, okay, Chance, I don't think you can finish cooking. Let me go back and double check, make sure he didn't leave the house. I bet you he left the house with everything cooking. Is it in there? Mm, I don't know. I'm going to assume it's not. If we come back because there's a fire on our lot, then we'll know why. Okay, is it open yet? No, it's not open. That's okay. Instead of wasting your time waiting on these crazy people to come over here and do their job, go over here to the fire department and you can start inventing. And I'm not going to let you stay there long. We're going to come back over here and check it. But I don't think they get in there until like either 8 or 9 o'clock. So you should, be able, you should be able to actually invent a little bit. And what I probably ought to do is have him, I'm going to have him make something big which is going to take him some time, which means he's going to have to come over here quite a bit. He's going to make, what's the biggest thing he can make? He can make the harvester. And once he sells that, he actually makes good money for it. Where are you going, Brighton? Um, so you go ahead and do that. A fire has started in our lot. Of course it did. Uh, let's see how long it's going to take till the fire... Oh, man. Of course it did. Um, will the fire department show up, please? Because nobody's home. I knew better. I knew it. I knew he wasn't going to have enough time, but I did it anyway. Well, I'm so glad they have money. Let's see if the fire department actually makes it here, but we did have the fire alarm go off. Didn't we? Yeah, it did. Um, Twinbrook Fire Department. Your response time is pathetic. Oh, there they come. You can see them. Right, are you still working? Yeah, he's still making that thing. Get in here, bust the door down, do whatever you gotta do. Take care of our stuff. We're losing our beverage maker, we're losing our oven, and we're losing a countertop. Yikes. Okay. We appreciate you being here to do it. Since we just... Okay, I guess we didn't really... Oh man, now we gotta clean this up. Okay, if that's the worst that happened, then I'm okay with it. We can... Ah, why did I do that? Okay. Is there, I wish there was an undo. I should have just sold it and got them a decent one. Because they had the worst stove possible. Alright, that's okay. It's $400. And we're, we're doing okay. Alright, what she's going to do is, just like yesterday, she is going to hold some meetings after work. And I don't care how many you got to do. Let's try uh, just several of them. Chance, you're meeting new friends, that's good for you. Brighton, while you're doing that, I'm going to check in this consignment store. I don't know if it'll let me do it, but I want to see if anybody's there. 
Let's see, let's go down. Okay, somebody's here. So, tell you what. You go ahead, because she doesn't stay there, and you're probably going to be doing this all day. Go ahead and come over here, and let's get these things sold. We'll at least get some money for today. And then I'll send you back over there to finish up. Bar. A shark racket. And it's a werewolf. Alright, sell your stuff. Let's see, what can you consign? A drinking llama? Improved drinking llama? Oh yeah, you've got a few things to sell. They're not worth a whole lot. Um, yeah, nothing's really big. That's it. Ah, that's pretty pathetic. I can sell the pumpkin seeds, but I don't think anybody's going to buy them. All right, we're going to go ahead, stop there. Then let me get you back over to the fire department. If we can sell a couple of things like the harvester, then once we start selling the big stuff, all right, stop. Don't go all the way back there. Go ahead and finish this. You're at 32%. So you finish that one up, and you'll make a lot of money. Well, not a lot, but you'll make decent money. Just don't catch on fire. We've already had one fire today. Okay. And how many more days does he have? Oh! Okay, that's just depressing. He's got three days to becoming an elder. Right, and you poor guy. Which, once he hits Elder status, I believe I have him down to a seven-day lifespan, and that's it. So, Brighton, you've got summer, and you might make it through fall. Or you'll make it through fall, but you won't make it through winter. Chance, you just made it on the honor roll. Very good. Chance, how much time do you have left? Because I know graduation's coming up. Okay, you got four days left. Okay. And I think he's got... He's got decent skills. Well, he's got a little bit of athletic and a little bit of logic and handiness. He doesn't really have a whole lot, to be honest with you. Okay, so he wants to make the stove fireproof. Yeah, a little too late. Come on, Brighton. Let's get this thing finished up. Oh, good, he did it. Squabbling scientist settlement. Hold a meeting at the science facility. Okay, wait a minute. Tell you what. Let's go back into map view. Let's go over here. Um, where is the science one? This back over here. Don't do your meeting here. Do your meeting here. Okay, something happened. I think she just made, she just got level 10. Wow, she just, she just maxed out her career. No wonder. Go ahead and hold some more meetings. At least I think she did. So yeah, she got her lifetime wish. It says... She completed her lifetime wish, and she has got a bonus of 1728. She now makes 255 an hour. Brighton, what are you doing? No, you're not doing this. You're going to go back to the consignment store before they shut down. Mm, yeah, go over here. Let's get this thing up here to sell. Hurry before 5 o'clock, and maybe it'll get in today's work. I don't know. back the jams. Yes, we'll do that. Alright, go ahead and go ahead and buy some stuff, which you're not really buying, you're consigning. It's a good deal. He's going to get there before 5 o'clock. It may not get sold today, but if it does, it'll be the one that actually gives us the most money. Alright, so the only thing you have is a harvester, which is worth 400 Much better. Alright. Let's go ahead and clo close out of that one, and Brighton, you can go ahead and go on home. How much do you have in your inventory? Yeah, you didn't use as much scrap as I thought. But the thing is, once he sells that, he's going to make a decent amount of money. Um, he only needs to make 612 to get up to the next level, and he might do it. He, if that one sells, he'll do pretty well. Chance, you're doing your homework, I bet. No, you're going to read that book again? Come on, home. I know you're going to talk to that friend. What's that guy? Listen. To, oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Who's accusing you of what? Listen to an accusation. What's he going to accuse you of? Paparazzi? Well, you know what? If he does this, then you are just, oh, you're wrong. going to tear into him, just like, your, just like your granddad did right here in the... Well, he did in front of the hospital. Um, man with the crazy hair, where are you going? We're over here. 
Yeah, I know I went. Okay, Brighton, you did pretty good. I'm sure you just leveled up. Uh-huh. Now what are you gonna do? Chief, Johnny's oh. You guys are pickled, you don't know what you're doing. Alright, so if you guys are gonna be nice, be nice. Brighton, don't watch TV. Don't watch TV. You're good. Let's go ahead and let's make another harvester. Let me take a look at these messages here. Let's see. Brighton has been conferred the new title of experienced innovator by the Twinbrook Town Council. Town Council, and he is now. Let's see. Whether it's a new toy, they know they can depend on your quality. He got a $500 cash award. So how much does he need to go for the next one? He's level five. He needs to get 2,000. All right, you're gonna do this, and then I'm gonna have you continue on after that. Okay. Jillian, you should be making some money for this. How much did you get for that? I have no idea. You don't have any idea. But see, now you're driving the style, living in a little shack out in the low rent side of town. Only in Twinbrook. Okay, she's going on to her next meeting. And now, you know, you're going to play football with this guy? Or is it somebody else? Oh, it's somebody else. Who is this? Cherish Curious. Oh, she's got an arm on her, doesn't she? Uh huh. Who's that over there? Not so curious. Okay. All right. And of course, there goes my alarm. So that means I need to start wrapping this up pretty quick. Let me go back to Brighton, make sure he hasn't set himself on fire. We've got over fifty thousand now. So this little house, like I said, it's not the money anymore. Now it's just the fact that um, there's not a whole lot available. Now there was one available, and I can show it to you. Chances up to level three. Ow, of course, it's gonna rain. Gotta love that. I can show you where we could go, and I'm thinking about it. There's a reason why it would work, and it's in this little house right here. And if I go in here into build by mode, you can uh, just take a look real quick and see. It's a one bedroom. Um, it has this bedroom back over here, which would be great when uh, when Chance actually is on his own. And of course, that's gonna be a while. But everything else in the house is really nice. It looks good. Let me go ahead. On. Okay, so it actually looks pretty good. It's much better than what we've got. I'm probably 90% sure we're going to do this. But I could actually take this room over here and I could turn it into Chance's room. Um, I could actually extend on here and make another bathroom for him. It'd be basically the same that he's got right now. But this is a nicer setup. It's in the nicer side of town. It's right here on the water. And yeah, I'm thinking this is probably it. And we can actually still use um, all the stuff. We can keep the sculpting the sculpting tool or uh, table so that Jillian can start learning that because I want her to do that now that she's maxed out her career so more than likely when you come back we'll be heading up I'll be packing everything up and we'll be going over here to this house and I'll be making some changes on it just to actually make it more accommodating for our house only problem is there's not much of a yard so if you really wanted to do anything in the backyard you're kinda out of luck uh, everything's gonna have to be done on the deck which is fine they got plenty of deck that's for sure and I could actually put something up here and make it a gate or something and that way it's not quite so open to the burglars when they come through. Of course they can get in anyway. Alright, so that's anywhere. That's my only thought. Everything else, I'm kind of stuck with nothing else that I can do. And I look in through the house. The house is here. This one's a one bedroom and it's when I looked at it, it's tiny. It'd be hard to fit. That one's a one bedroom. There's really nothing that we can work with. Um, I would love it if one of these, this one's a one bedroom nothing over here is working for us and we can't really afford anything here even if it were open so we're pretty much stuck dealing with what we're dealing with and of course we go over here we're dealing with the same thing we've got right now might as well stay where we're at so that's basically the only option unless I want to build something and I really don't want to build anything uh, I wanted to check this house yeah that one's still taken and then the one way out here that I did like I think this poor guy he's now got four people in the house so we're not going to get in that house unless we actually move in and manipulate them and then move them out. The one I was talking about, though, that has the one guy, it's this house right here. It's um, He is there by himself, and I could evict him. I could find another place for him. I don't know how much the house would cost. I'm not sure if we could afford it, but it actually it's a two-bedroom, two-bath, and I think, I think it would be actually pretty good. So I'm still trying to think if... We may or may not move. I don't know. Because I kind of want to go here. It's a better side of town. So, I don't know. We'll we'll play it, play it by ear for the next time and see what happens. Okay, 
Jillian, you're working. Chance, come home. You can use your umbrella. Yeah, you need to come on home. I think you did your um, your homework, so I don't let you do it now. Yeah, you did your homework, so you're good. All right, I'm going to go ahead and end the part here. When we come back, of course, Chance is going to fi finish up having something to eat. Um, make autumn salad. You can't burn the house down with that. So when we come back, we'll actually worry about either thinking about moving or at least bumping him up. I think it's good. We actually got two careers advanced in this episode, and Chance is getting close to the end of his teenage life, and then he'll be able to move on and be an adult, and he'll start making some money as well. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time.